guys exploring with Jay here. First and foremost, I want to thank each and every one of you that have stuck around the last three months that I have not put a single video out. It means a lot to me. I've been dealing with a lot of stuff last couple of months. Um, some pretty serious harassment towards me and my family, um, which has not stopped. That's about all I can say about that. Um, I am here just north of Stillwater, checking out the Stillwater Cave, if I can find it. But uh, this is where we're at. Pretty cool. A walkway up there. That makes you wonder where that goes. How the hell you get to it without killing yourself, breaking your back on these rocks? I'll pass. <laughs> it's like quite the tunnel, though. I don't think that's the cave. Man, look at the size of this fucking tree. Cottonwood. This thing's been here for a long, long time. Look at that beast. That big old cottonwood. Obviously, it's a storm drain. See all the wash out here. Runs along this beautiful cliffside. Some graffiti, not uh, terrible. I've seen worse. Spray paint can there. It'd be like Tarzan's, they're swinging from these vines. <laughs> well, looks like there might be. Somebody camping out or something down here. See some red right in here. We're gonna stay away from that. Don't know who they are. Yeah, that's a tent. So we'll go this way. We'll leave them be. I don't know if they're just camping out or if they're homeless or what the case is. Oh, got somebody here. Hello guys. On the cave. Check this out. Trying to turn on my EMF detector. It's getting pretty dark in here though. Might have to switch to my other camera. Yeah, all right, I got my EMF detector out. Here's the other direction. Might have to screenshot that. I'm gonna switch to my other camera.
There's a hole there. I don't know if that goes anywhere. There's a cricket there. Well, this was bricked off a long time ago. So this cave probably does go back a ways. see nothing down there. Definitely too small for my fat ass to get through there. So I guess we're stuck here. Graffiti. Yeah, it looks like I might turn to the right a little bit. The wall goes from there to there. Interesting. If it was a bigger opening, I'd go back there. Last thing I need to do is get fucking stuck. A hole there. EMF detector's been quiet. Saying it's zero. Yeah, it doesn't go very far. At least not to this part anyway. Kind of disappointing. Own the day. Yes, sir, on the day. Oh, what do we got here? It's like a collection of glass, some beer bottle caps, a lot of glass in here. Hey, stand up straight. Yeah, I was hoping this was deeper. Oh well. Bell boys. Escape the bull crap. That don't say crap though. Pretty much the cave. I don't know, disappointing. Outside here, though, this is the uh, St. Croix River. Alright, I'm going to switch back to my other camera. Yeah, that's known as a Stillwater Cave, I guess. Again, I don't know how far back it actually goes past the brick wall that's packed there, but maybe someday we'll find out. Ooh, ferns growing inside there, that's pretty cool. Someone's lighting up fireworks in there or something. Oh, what do we got here? Check this out. Oh, this is cool. This is a underground spring. Yeah. Popping right out of the ground like that. That's awesome. Oh, 
thousand years from now, that'll be a cave. Running right along the rock strata. That is cool. Goes right into the St. Croix River. Sheer cliff. Oh, beautiful. Come down here in the fall, that's really beautiful. All the fall colors. Tell where the water line used to be. Far down has gone in the last few days. Go that way. Man, it's so peaceful. Yeah, what the hell? Ooh. Fisherman's trash. It's always nice. remind myself to play back this part of the video I thought I just heard a voice felt like hell this camera picked it up but Yeah, another spring. <clears throat> Showing up. No spring comes popping out of there. Not as big as the other one. Well, it's probably branching off of that spring anyway, deep inside the rock. Well, yeah, look at that. Some kind of nest up there. All in all, though, for this area, I mean, it seems pretty damn clean. I mean, you do this along the Mississippi, and you're finding all kinds of trash. Uh, I mean, even stuff like refrigerators still full of food, things like that. St. Croix is a lot cleaner. Somebody carved some stuff in there. I was hoping maybe there was another cave. I don't think so. I'm gonna start heading back. I'm gonna go check out another area.
If I find something interesting, I'll turn you back on. All right, guys. I wasn't going to do it at first, but I had decided what the hell. We're out here, right? Have some fun. I found a skull. Uh, it's not what you think. It's not human. But I found a skull. Check this out. All right. So here's it in my head here, right? Got these little itty bitty tiny holes here. Check this out. I'm gonna tilt my camera. I'm gonna stick you right down in that little tiny hole right there. Check that out. Yeah. Little skull of some sort in there. Mouse, ball maybe, who knows? It's a little tiny skull. A little tiny creature. I thought it was cool. Hey right, guys. I'm uh, pretty much done with this adventure. A little bit disappointed the cave didn't really go as far as I really wanted it to. But what do you do? Um, I could have tried crawling in there, got stuck, nobody knows where I'm really at, and then wait for someone to come tickle my feet, and I'll pass. Uh, besides my feet, it's that ticklish. Anyway, um, Again, I want to thank all you guys that uh, stuck around with me. I know I haven't posted a video in, what, three months? But, uh, yeah, I've been real busy doing other stuff. Uh, like I said, dealing with the harassment case. Uh, I really got screwed on. Um, now, basically, what's, what's happening is I'm being, pretty much being forced to move. I mean, not technically. I could stay where I'm at and deal with this person's bullshit, but I really don't want to. Um, I really am in fear of the safety for myself and my family. I don't know what this person is capable of, and I don't want to find out. So, uh, yeah, we're, we're moving at the end of uh, September here, so I've been busy packing. Packed in and racked in and stacked in and all that stuff. Uh, I've got another spot lined up where to live, uh, not too far away, but far enough away where I don't have to deal with uh, this bullshit anymore. Uh, plus, i uh, got a bit of a cancer scare in the family. Uh, got, uh, we're trying to take care of that and uh, hope for the best on that. Um, possible uh, promotion at work. Um, all kinds of different stuff going on right now. It's been um, a really hectic uh, summer and it's been a really hectic fall and it's it's still going on. So um, I, I am trying to get more more videos out, trying to get back into it after all this time and whatnot. I do have a couple of spots lined up that I do want to check out and bring the camera with me to show you guys um, it is fall so metal detecting season is kind of coming to an end I got some time yet on that but not much um, basically uh, figure I got roughly about two and a half months of metal detecting left maybe two months I figure grounds gonna get pretty much frozen over in about November so be about the last dig then uh, but again I haven't had time to get out and do pretty much anything between work and uh, oh, get my son ready for uh, kindergarten and all that uh, you know shots and physicals and school supplies and all that good fun stuff see so, yeah, I've been a busy boy uh, I apologize if you guys uh, felt neglected I'm really not, uh, I'm not giving up on my channel by any means. I just had to take a break for a little bit and take care of uh, some life issues, I guess. So, um, enough of that BS. A um, couple nights ago, actually it was the last, last night of August, we had a pretty decent storm that came through. Uh, lots of lightning and wind and actually knocked the power out for about two hours I was very impressed been uh, lived in my apartment there for almost 10 years and it's the first time the power has ever been knocked out by a storm uh, why it was knocked out I 
I'm not sure. Don't know if the tree fell on something or what have you. It's just all of a sudden lights out. So I was bored and felt like there was nothing better to do. Grab my camera and step out on the balcony and uh, take some shots of uh, the lightning. So I'll share that with you. next adventure not sure where or what I'm gonna do here got uh, some places I'm gonna look and uh, research and whatnot hopefully I'll see you guys soon and uh, again I want to thank you from the bottom of my heart for sticking around with me and I apologize for the long delay and, uh, hopefully these uh, more of these videos will come out soon <laughs> <laughs>